Hello guys, so welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends, welcome back to Realm Royale Reforged. And today, we're going to be recording a video on the Starburst Sorcerer skin within 2023. Honestly, I really am enjoying these Realm Royale videos and obviously whenever you guys see these videos, I just hope that you all enjoy them because as it is for me, I love the game, I think the game's amazing. Yes, it doesn't get all the content and doesn't get regular updates as much as we would like. But still, to me, this game has been something that I've been very passionate about here on the channel. I love my Call of Duty content. I love playing games like Realm. And yes, I may not upload videos on it all the time. But to me, this game is very special to me. And whenever I do make videos on it, you can see that. But other than that, though, I've got plenty more content still to come on this. Obviously, when we have all the new map and everything... I will be making videos on it as well, and despite the fact that, you know, I'm waiting for some new skins for this game, Asitas, I'm excited for what the future has in store for this game. I know Thor and the developers are working on this game. I've got some great things in line. I know that they've got some good things coming to this game soon, and they're just, they're just there making more and more and more, and the moment when it comes to the game, I know we're all going to love it. So we're just going to be patient. And enjoy what we've got, and obviously, the time will come when we get some brand new stuff that we're going to be absolutely blown away with. But that being said, though, let's get into the action, and let's try and get a W with this skin today, okay? Let's get a Crown Royale, boys. And obviously, if you want to see even more videos on Realm Royale here on the channel, smash the thumbs up button, and subscribe if you new. would really, really appreciate it. Let's get into it. And obviously as well, I feel like I owe you guys a little bit of an explanation on why I haven't been uploading as much recently. I've had a little bit of a break from YouTube. It's only because, like, I've been... F well, it was. I'll, I'll be straight up and honest with you all. As much as I love uploading daily, I do love uploading videos. I do love making videos. But with all the stress and stuff I've been getting from work where I, f I feel like I'm having to do this and do this and do this. I'm not going to go into too much detail, but... It's like, it's kind of took a bit of a burnout effect on me where I've just wanted to come in, either sleep, or I've wanted to come home and just relax because I've just been feeling so stressed out with work and stuff. So it's kind of made me feel unmotivated, feeling really low on myself. So I've had a little bit of a break just from what I normally do. And with that, I've decided that, you know, I have a little bit of a break from YouTube and then see how I feel after, you know, a little bit of a break. And now, I still feel a little bit like, not 100% in myself, but I feel better to the point where I can, I'm ready to start making videos again. If that makes sense. I can't describe it in words because it's just like, it's hard to just explain. The fog but sets in. It's like, I've just been feeling like burnt out. That's how I kind of felt, you know what I mean? Burnt out and just unmotivated, like I just felt drained because I'll be honest with you, I love my job and stuff and love what I do as a job, but it's one of them where with what I do at work, it's just been bringing a lot of stress on me lately. And I'll be honest with you, a lot of the time, all I've been wanting to do is just sleep when I get home, just sleep. And I've not really wanted to, you know, make videos, and it's just been one of them things. But now, because things are just, you know, I've, I've relaxed, I've took my mind off things. I feel, in, I feel a little bit better, more better on myself after a couple of days of not uploading and I'm ready. You know what I mean? I'm ready to get back into the action and start making videos again. So that's the reason why you've not been seeing, like, consistent videos lately on both channels. But now that I'm getting my mind back into it again, I'm going to start trying my best to pump out more content for you all the best I can, okay? Right. Let's try and find some enemies. Do 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 do. Where is everyone? Hmm. Why isn't this magical? 
Well, I've got my two, st uh, got my two staffs now, so staffs, got my freeze, my ice block, and I've got me uh, fire blast. Someone's nearby. No, well, I'm going to let them go at each other at the moment. I'm just going to try and get myself all looted up ready. Staff in this direction. I can hear him, but I can't see him. Surprisingly, there wasn't a chest there. There normally was a chest there, normally. So yeah, let me know your thoughts and opinions on the skin, by the way. Have you got the skin inside your Realm Royale skin collection? Let me know. Like, for me, I remember it was a while ago that I got the skin in, like, a bundle. It was, like, on the store and I brought it. And it literally was, yeah, it was a long time ago. And to be honest, I like this skin. I think it's a pretty cool skin to have inside the with, with the mage class and stuff. There's a lot of cool skins within this game. And I don't mind skins that have, like, different... Like colors of like existing skins. Like for example, we've seen it with the um, the OG skins, but it's just a black and gold version of the default skins and stuff. And I don't mind it. You now I mean, it's just something different to use. But I do like it when the developers go like completely like wacky and start pointing some like unique skins that you just wouldn't expect to see in the game. Like for example, the shark tank skin and stuff. You know what I mean? And then they made it into a mount skin as well, where you can play as a shark. But then you can ride around on a shark on the land, and I think it's just crazy and unique. Oh, enemy, enemy, enemy. Really bad potato aim, but you know what? I'm still doing the job, boys. I'm still doing the job. Right. I wish you could just shoot that down. It'd just be so much easier. Imagine if you could do that. Alright, let's go get that um, chest and see if we get anything good inside that of there. I wouldn't mind the gatekeeper, to be honest, if it was in there. Come on, give me something good. Yeah. Not the best of stuff, but it'll do. Because obviously now I've got my two staffs. The fire staff's going to obviously end up doing a lot more damage than the ice staff. Um, obviously we've got my barricade in case enemies are shooting at me. So I can still shoot them, but they can't shoot me for a short period of time. If I'm standing behind my barricade. And obviously I've got my fire blast so I can use as like more of a counter attack. So if you just think about it, you can use that in like sort of a gameplay sort of perspective where... I can put down my barricade when an enemy is shooting at me, and then through my barricade I can fire my fire blast at them. Which I think, you know, can make some interesting strategies with it, you know what I mean? Oh, enemy, enemy, enemy. Oh, 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 oh. Make some fried chicken. Definitely gonna take it. Ooh, I sense powerful magic. Certainly is. Right, where do we go to next though? Do I go back to crossing? Might be an option. Or do I go elsewhere? So 
30 players remained on the map as well. Yeah, crossing's the best bet because obviously I can hear people. There's people here, boys. Ooh, enemy, enemy, enemy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's still my kill. That's my kill. That's what happens when you try and steal my kills. I've had enough people do that to me before in the past, and, you know, it's not a nice thing to do. It's my kill, okay? It's my kill. So let's go hit the forge. So yeah, we need the usual things, you know, the health, their armor. Um, some more armor. Do my fire blast ability, if we can get like an epic or a legendary. And get all this stuff as well, so we get even more shards. There's a lot of loot here. So I might as well turn it into something useful. And obviously as well, on the forge as well, I've got the um, fire staff as my default weapon of choice. So obviously I can use the forge to get the fire staff if it says that I didn't have one for whatever strange reason. Why isn't this magical? So as you can see, I can now forge myself a fire staff. So hopefully, oh I'm going to get an epic one because it's purple. So if you can see where he's got the countdown thing, if it's purple... It means you're gonna get an epic. If you get like, if it's yellow, yeah, you're gonna get the legendary. Loving the moves. There we go. Certainly is. Well, your boy's ready for a fight now. Nice. <laughs> yes, we definitely need a health ability. As much as I love the fire blast, we're going to need a health ability. Just so then, obviously, now we can use it like as a different sort of playstyle now because we've got two staffs. My well, fire staff's going to cause even more damage. We've got the ice staff because obviously it fires out faster projectiles. And then, obviously, got the barricade. So when enemies are shooting at me, I can then put my barricade up and hide behind it and shoot people. And if it says that, you know, I'm in a situation where I'm taking a lot of hits, I can put my barricade up, whack down my healing station, heal up in the process, and then get straight back into the action. So, to be honest, I'm pretty much set right now. All they need to do now is get some more kills. And to be honest, there isn't that many players left on the map either. We've only literally got 16 more players left now, so... If I'm going to get into any gunfights, I'm going to need to get into them very soon. Well, I just hope that each and every single one of you out there are having a fantastic day today, that you're all safe and well. And if you want to see even more videos on Realm Royale Reforged, then just let me know down below in the comment section. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, enemy, enemy, enemy. Despite my potato aim, I'm still shooting them. Zaz, zaz, zaz. Dropped him. Got six eliminations so far. Fire staff up to legendary. Uh, come on. Oh, enemies are nearby. Someone's here. Where is he? Oh, 
Is that, is that, is that? Take him, take him. Nice. Seen him. Come on, let's try and take him. Let's try and take him. They put you trying to hide behind the bush. Easy, boys. Ten plays left right now. Come on. Let's try and get this crown royale. And obviously the grind does continue for me when it comes to the classes as well. Once I've done all of the mage skins, I will obviously move on to other classes. I'm thinking after I've done the mage, I'm probably going to do the assassin's class or something next. Because, I don't know, I've, I've done a lot of progression with the, with the assassin's class over the years. And, I don't know, I'm thinking maybe I should do that class next. And I could try and go for the uh, mastery skin. And obviously, if he, anything go by with the oh, like with the recent roadmaps and stuff that we've been seeing, there's a lot of things that are you know currently being worked on and being considered by High Res Studios as well. Like we got new classes coming in the future, a new map, new modes, more skins, potentially new abilities, and more. So it's it's gonna be awesome, man! I can't wait for the future for this game. The big thing I'm more excited about is a map because a lot of Battle Royale games have like, they've got new maps and everything coming out quite regularly but for Realm we've always had the same map and a new playground to run around on and just obliterate people with, it just gets me ever so excited for it man because I can't wait, it's going to be awesome. Even if it is just a smaller map, you know what I mean, that'll be, that new map that they mentioned will be like Realm Royale's version of Rebirth, you know what I mean? Where the hell is everyone? Can't see anyone. Who's in here? Who's in here? That boy, screw that. It's getting circle, getting circle. I won't mind having a gatekeeper to be honest. Oh, someone's got a sniper. Need to be careful. Where's the sniper shot come from? Where the hell is everyone? Oh, is that, is that? Got him. There we go, boys. He's dropping him. Literally three players left on the map now. Two more enemies I need to obliterate. One more enemy now. Come on. Where is he? Around here somewhere. I've got a feeling he might be in that house. Let's 
It's around here somewhere. Come on, where is he? I can hear him. I don't think he knows where I am. So I'm just staying in the circle. Is that the other building? Might be in the other building, to be honest. I think he is. Yeah, he is. He's right there. Oh. Oh, he's, he's on, boys. It's on. It's on. So you point getting in there, bro. It's running. Got him. Got him. There we go. <laughs> 12 eliminations, my friends. Hopefully you all enjoyed today's video. If you did, smash the thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new for want to see even more videos on Realm Royale Reforged. That, my friends, is the Star Burst Sorcerer skin for the Mage class within 2023. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you all again next time.